Hello and welcome back to another lecture. In this lecture, we will upload our key pair into GitHub. In the last lecture, you created a key pair. So the next thing you need to do is upload the public key of that key pair into GitHub. Once you've done that, then you will be able to clone your GitHub repository. To upload the public key of our key pair into GitHub, the first thing I want you to do is open the file explorer. Once you've opened the file explorer, Let's go to the location where we saved our key pair. My key pair is on the C drive in the users folder. I'll click admin and I'll click .ssh and my key pair is in here. The key we want to upload to GitHub is the public key and it is the one with the P sign. So the next thing you need to do is right click on it, come down to open with and select notepad. So once you select that, it is going to open that key here and it is a long key. All you have to do is put your cursor at the start, then press Ctrl A to select everything, then right click and copy. Once you have copied the content of your public key, make sure you don't change anything in here because it is an encryption key. The next thing I want you to do is close this file. I'll close it. And I'm going to go back to GitHub. Once you've logged into your GitHub account, we'll select this logo up here. I select settings. Under settings, select SSH and GPG keys. Under SSH keys, select new SSH key. Then give the SSH key a name. I'll call it my public key. Once you've given it a name, in here, we are going to paste that key pair in there. And this is all you need to do. First, you give it a title and on that key, paste the content of your public key in here. Once you have pasted the content of your public key, click add SSH key. We have successfully uploaded our public SSH key into GitHub. Now that we have uploaded the public key pair into GitHub, we can clone our GitHub repository to our computer. This is how you upload a public key pair into GitHub. If you have any question or there's any part of this lecture you don't understand, please leave your comments below. Thank you and I'll see you in the next lecture. Bye.